I would like to formally introduce the newest addition to our mischief, Cyclone. She's a five-week-old champagne rat with the cutest little white markings on her head. I got Cyclone a week ago and was originally not going to post any videos of her for a while, but then I remembered that I get questions every day about how I bond with a new rat. So I decided to film our journey and take you guys through the process with us. So let's get into it. The day I brought Cyclone home, I placed her in a temporary cage with toys, food, water, and plenty of places to hide. <laughs> My money don't jiggle jiggle, it folds, I'd like to see you wiggle wiggle, for sure. She's itty bitty and will hopefully only be in this cage for around a month, so this temporary smaller cage is just perfect for her. I also make sure to put her in a separate room away from my other two rats, as Cyclone will need to be quarantined for two weeks to avoid any possible sicknesses being spread around. For the first two days, I always leave new rats alone completely. It's important for them to get used to their new surroundings without any added anxiety or pressure. I don't try to touch them or get them out of their cage, but I do make sure to walk by the cage and talk to myself just so the new rat gets used to my voice and presence. On the third day, I started sitting next to Cyclone's cage with the door open. Rats are naturally very curious animals, and young female rats especially are very energetic, so I figured Cyclone would be itching to get out and explore. I lured her out with some treats, and she automatically started climbing and sniffing and doing normal rat shit, just like I thought she would. Day four is when I started encouraging Cyclone to climb out of her cage and into my hands. I was very patient with her and didn't force her to do anything she didn't want to. It's important to let a new rat make their own decisions in order to strengthen the bond and trust between Chaos Potato and Chaos Potato owner. If this step takes a few days or even weeks to complete, that's okay. Every rat is different. By day five, this brave little girl was already stepping out on my hands to go explore. Because she seemed to trust me enough, I started taking her to different spots in my bedroom because she absolutely loves exploring new places and running around. This is a video of us on day six, and as you can see, Cyclone is very much living up to her name. She's a playful little ball of energy, and I can already tell that her and my criminal sin are gonna get along great. She's super sweet, brave, chaotic, and I'm so excited to start the introduction process with her and my two girlies next week. I will be filming that as well, so make sure you like this video and come back later for more Cyclone content. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments. Bye! And ratty kisses to you all!